teaching someone work ethic, teaching someone to want better for themselves is incredibly hard. And that's one of the things we are seeing uh, with the academy is we have floods of phone calls and people aren't thinking of it in an entrepreneurial way. They're thinking of it like, well, how can you put me to work when after, after I get certified? Well, we certainly are gonna help you do that. We have all of the connections to do that, but we can't make you work hard and practice extra and become a master at your craft unless you are driven and ambitious to do that. I mean, money is a motivator uh, and you can, I mean, really make a lot a lot of it, but some, some people are just not motivated um, by money or anything. So they, uh, I usually know in the first couple weeks during the academy, if they start catching on, if they're really asking more questions than the other guy, like, you know, like, what can I do next? What, or this guy's just happy with working and doing what I'm telling him to do. I like to, to really, I love the guy that's always two, trying to be two steps ahead, even though I'm trying to reel him back because that means he's hungrier than the guy and the, that's just happy with what I tell him. The yeah, one thing that sticks out to me whenever I was training, I remember Jason, the guy that trained me, told me, you know, either do you want to be the man or do you want to work for the man? And that was motivation for me.